the thing is, uh, Car, I've been all over Nebraska because my career is on fire. <laughs> but I've been to like Kearney and Columbus and Omaha and Lincoln. I've been all over Nebraska. And the rest of Nebraska's fine. They got cable, they got the thumb. It's all working out for them, the rest of Nebraska. North Platte, Nebraska, morons. Morons, quite honestly. I was mistaken for a local, which is usually not a problem. In, in a small town for me, but uh, in North Platte, Nebraska, it means that I was having a beverage at the bar before the show began, and a giant man thought I was someone he knew. So I'm standing at the bar, and this huge guy is walking towards me, screaming at me at the top of his lungs. Who said you could get out of the truck? <laughs> that is a bad night of comedy. It's not going to go well. The stand-up comedy is not going to be very positive when you're mistaken for some lug's battered wife right off the bat. I don't know. It's not a good, and it's not like I don't like small towns. I love a small town. Actually, um, I was in Fairbanks, Alaska last year doing the troops, which never comes out right. But don't go to Fairbanks, Alaska, by the way, in the middle of the winter, A, eh? and then uh, announce to a full bar that you've never been on a snowmobile because there will be a man who's had a couple of beers, who says, we're going, right now, we're going. And that man's wife will have clothes for you. Because they're good people. And what you'll do is you'll get into that guy's $500 truck. And you will drive to his $14,000 home. So that you can get on to his $27,000 snowmobile. Because he's got his ducks in a row. Because he's no, he knows what's at his bread is buttered. Whatever. 